And thank you for joining us. I'm Mike Deneau. After the huge Silmar earthquake, the county began a program in 1976 to make sure all dams in L.A. County were thoroughly inspected to withstand another major quake. Now millions of dollars and countless work hours later, the Big Tahanga is the 13th dam to complete retrofitting. After years of construction and about 700,000 hours of man and woman power, the Big Tahunga Dam's retrofitting is finally complete. We seismically retrofitted the dam, improved its ability to handle earthquakes, and we also improved its ability to handle large storm events, more than what we'd expect, experience in any 100-year period. Since the Silmar quake, L.A. County has spent more than $100 million upgrading their 13 major dams. The latest, Big Tahunga, will now save a lot of water. We're going to save about 4,500 acre feet of uh, water, but it's also going to protect the people down below from uh, uh, the various storms that would occur. In layman's terms, dam officials say they've increased Big Tahunga's water conservation to about 9,000 families of four for one year. Just a massive project to complete. More than 7,000 trucks full of concrete went into retrofitting the new Big Tahunga Dam. Uh, it's, it started with you know blasting the slopes off. All these slopes are, are new. Uh, hanging the equipment off and rebuilding them, putting ties in the, in the slopes, and then building the new dam in front of it. A lot of work in a relatively short amount of time with some serious obstacles to boot. And that included... Uh, you know, uh, being shut down with the fires, because remember, this was the area of the station fires. You know, this whole area, I think uh, a couple hundred thousand acres. The Big Tahunga Dam was originally built in 1931 at a cost of just over one million dollars.